Coming straight from the KTM Factory Racing newsletter, Aaron Plessinger, after evaluations, this, as far as I'm, as far as I know, today has been confirmed to have a fractured elbow after the practice one or session one round at Foxboro, which sucks for him. Um, he ended up posting the day of Foxboro saying, quote, not the news I wanted to report tonight. I hope I won't be racing after a practice crash in session one, tweak my elbow and not feeling comfortable enough to race. One for the team with all the hard work they put in and sorry to all the fans that came out to watch me race. Obviously that came out during the day. So everyone knew it was a thing. And after evaluations, it's confirmed that he has a fractured elbow. And as far as I know, somebody in the comments below, correct me if I'm wrong here. This is the last year of his contract with KTM. I'm, maybe I'm wrong about that, but I don't think I am. And it sucks for him because at the moment, he is 7th with 60 point, 63 points down. So I think at one point, he was he was probably 6th after before this race because he's only 8 points behind Jason Anderson. And he's had a good year. Like, sadly, it's one of those things that just you get injured and now who knows? Uh, <laughs> apparently, he is, I mean, obviously, he's going to have some surgery to fix whatever is actually wrong. Well, you know, fractured, but whatever. And then aim for the pro motocross opener, which he always does good outdoors. So I'm not really worried about that. It's just going to be a factor of how long is he going to be back on the bike before that opener? Is he going to be a fit and is the elbow going to be healthy? And, you know, if you're looking at Christian Craig, we know those can be problems. So hopefully he comes back. Hopefully he's fine. And we see where he does outdoors because, I mean, he's looked good. I think he probably probably deserves another one or two year contract to see where they go. It also depends on who else comes up free, but I don't know. You guys tell me. One, do you think he keeps his ride if the, this year with his contract coming up? How well do you think he does in outdoors? Who do you think wins the Supercross title between Webb and Jet Lawrence since it's way closer than anybody thought it was going to be, <laughs> me included? And whatever it is, comment down below. Tell me whatever you think, whatever it is. While you're down there, make sure to like, share, subscribe. Do all the fun things this platform lets you do because it really does help me out and I appreciate it. And with that, I'll see you later. Peace.